Hey everyone, welcome back to Bike Geek. In today's video, I'll show you the simplest way to install the latest version of Windows 11 without needing a USB drive and without losing any of your data. This method works perfectly on both supported and unsupported hardware. So, without further delay, let's dive in. The first thing you'll need is the Windows 11 ISO file. Open any web browser and search for Windows 11 ISO download. Click the official Microsoft website. It'll usually be the first link. Once you're there, scroll down to find the Download Windows 11 Disk Image section. Select Windows 11 Multi Edition from the drop down. Click Download and choose your product language. Before downloading, make sure you select the correct language that matches your current system setup. To find this, open Command Prompt as an administrator. Type this commands DISM space slash online space slash get dash intl. Press enter and it will display your default system UI language. In my case, it's English, United States. Match this language when downloading the ISO to avoid compatibility issues. After selecting the language, click confirm. Click 64-bit download. The ISO file is about 5.4 gigabytes, so be patient as it downloads. Once it's ready, locate the file, right-click and select Mount. If the Mount option isn't available, you can use tools like WinRAR to extract the contents, but I'll use the Mount option here. Once mounted, copy all the files from the ISO. Go to your Windows folder, Drive C. Create a new folder name, Windows 11, on your C drive and paste all the files there. Now, let's begin the installation. Open command prompt with Run as administrator. and navigate to the Windows 11 folder path. Copy this Windows 11 folder path, paste it on command line, type the following command, hit enter. This command will launch the Windows installation process, bypassing any compatibility checks for unsupported hardware. The installation window will open. Don't worry if it says Windows Server, it's just a workaround to bypass restrictions. Click change. How Setup Downloads Updates and select Not Right Now for Smoother Installation. Proceed with the steps. Click Accept to continue. Choose the option to keep files, settings and apps. Now, click Install and let the system upgrade to Windows 11. Sit back and relax. The process may take some time. Once it's done, your system will reboot, and voila, you've successfully installed Windows 11 operating system without a USB drive. After installation, you can delete the Windows 11 folder on your C drive to free up space. If you decide to stick with Windows 11, you can also remove the Windows old folder after 10 days. Also, if you want to downgrading back to Windows 10, no worries. Go to Start menu, then Settings, then scroll down and find the recovery option. And you'll see the option to go back to Windows 10 within 10 days. And that's it folks. You've now learned the easiest way to upgrade to Windows 11 without any hassle. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe to Bike Geek, and share this video with anyone who needs it. I'll see you in the next one.